All right, everybody. Um, just continuing on with my setup here at Lightbridge 2. I just want to show you guys a um, uh, setup that is working for me. All right, uh, and dispel one thing that may cause some confusion. Uh, I was confused about it myself. All right, it's the uh, if you're using two cameras. All right, you have so you have your external EXT, right, which is your gimbal camera if you're using an HD gimbal, and you're going to have. Uh, you can either have like an AV cam, which I haven't got this to work yet, but I haven't worked on it very long. Um, or you can have an HDMI feed, okay. and those go straight into those two ports, either one of those two ports on the Lightbridge Air Unit. So I'm just using an HDMI feed, all right, the included rib ribbon cable to this uh, SJ Cam M10. All right. So both these feeds work. Um, right now I'm, I'm set to external. Uh, one thing I thought, though, is that you were going to be able to get the picture-in-picture -picture feature on your device, and that does not happen. So the picture-in-picture -picture feature will only happen on an external monitor. All right, so I'm using this H uh, TV with an HDMI uh, input from the back of the transmitter, and you can see there's my uh, M10 using as an FP uh, FPV cam, and then obviously the gimbal feed right there. Okay, so the settings that work to get that all going. And I'm using Android, you can see, just ignore my iPad. I'm not gonna mess with the iOS one until I'm confident in it um, as far as troubleshooting. So I'm not gonna troubleshoot using the iPad, I'm just using this tiny little Android phone, which is terrible, but we'll get through this together. Okay, so the first thing, you remember to slide your bandwidth allocation. Um, I moved it 70-30, all right? So the, the M10, the little camera, is getting 30% of the bandwidth, and the um, GH3 on my GH4 gimbal is getting 70%. Remember to enable uh, HDMI SD uh, video output. You can only use one of those at a time. All right, so most of us are probably going to use HDMI, but make sure you set that correctly. Um, <clears throat> so your picture-in-picture -picture settings are right here. You can, if you set this right here, video output to LB, you're just going to get your HDMI input straight to the air unit or your FPV cam, whatever you, you use, your AV source. If you set it to EXT, you're only going to get your uh, gimbal through your HD gimbal cam. Um, PIP LB will get you a little picture in picture window of your HDMI or AV feed and a big picture of your gimbal camera and obviously the opposite for PIP EXT. So I'm going to use PIP LB and then if you go to oh, uh, no, not OSD settings. Right here, picture in picture for HDMI SDI. All right, you can select where you want that if you put it. So you can see it move wherever you want it on the screen. Okay, so picture in picture works. I haven't tr uh, tested on uh, iOS yet, but now that I've got it working on Android, I will. Uh, just just be aware because I just was running around in circles like, why is the picture in picture not working on this one? Uh, you're not going to get that on your device, okay? It's only going to happen on an external monitor. All right, so I'll keep the Lightbridge 2 troubleshooting and, you know, set up videos coming. Stick with it.